I just turned this design into this working dashboard app into surprisingly clean code using my APIs, my favorite libraries, my components, and even tests in less than five minutes. Let me show you how I did it. So first over in Figma, you can grab a link to this design over in the full blog post that I'll link to. We need to launch the builder.io plugin and simply hit the export to code button. I'll link to the Figma plugin as well in the blog post. That'll launch you into builder.io where we've converted the design into responsive code. And now is when we can start bringing things to life. The first thing I did is I added some custom instructions. Hit this button and add anything you want the AI system to be aware of. In my case, all I did was mention that I have this API with some params. I gave an example of what the output from it looks like, and I gave a couple additional suggestions, which you'll see the relevance for in a moment. I'll link to these instructions in the blog post as well. Now that the AI has some context about me, I can start making this design a real application. I'm just going to click this placeholder text and say, replace this with a table of our users. And now that the AI is aware of our APIs, it can generate within the context of this design, reusing the data and APIs that it knows exist. By default, the AI will replicate the styles and patterns that it sees. And if you integrate components from your code base, it'll actually reuse those as well. This table looks pretty good, so I'll accept it. And I can visually modify it as well. For example, I might want to go to the style tab and set the width to fill, and then maybe shrink up this spacing as well. Everything is fully visually and responsively editable. Now I have a table connected to real data, but there's other buttons here that don't work. For example, I have these sort by buttons. Now I'll do my favorite prompts. I'm just gonna click those buttons and say, make these buttons work. And given the context of the design, the fact these look like sorting buttons, and knowing that the API supports sorting, the AI will hook it all up for me. And I can jump into preview mode and we can see that our sort buttons work. We can now sort by location or name. Back in the editor, let's now go to the pagination buttons and let's do our favorite prompt too. Make these buttons work. The system is able to recognize that these are pagination buttons and hook up the pagination functionality accordingly. And now back in preview mode, I can try out our new pagination buttons and they work like a charm. Now, when I'm ready for the code, I can just hit the develop toggle. I can choose my preferred framework, including native outputs too, styling libraries, testing framework, etc., as well as add custom preferences and natural language. Like I want to use Tanstack query for all data fetching and then just hit the generate code button. We'll then generate code across several different files, creating and reusing components, as well as using semantic markup and general best practices. You can customize any of this code in any way you like, and it even will create TypeScript, prop types, etc., for you. On top of that, you can integrate your own design system. So it'll reuse your existing components when applicable as well. And the system will even generate tests in whatever preferred testing framework or library you use. This is currently saving me a ton of code writing, including the test styles and everything else. When it's all done, you can hit sync code and grab this command and then just run it in your project, tell it where you want the files, and then check out all your brand new beautiful code and tests and everything. You can see a more detailed write-up about all this in my full blog post on the builder.io blog. And also note that one of the features I showed here, the AI chat to modify the design is currently part of a rolling beta and not everyone has access just yet. If you don't, you can go to the blog post and sign up to be notified when access to your account has been granted. Can't wait to see all the amazing stuff you built with this.